Welcome to Seven Trumpets Prepper. And in this video, guys, I've got a very important announcement. On the 17th of April at 8 p.m. Central Time, or I'm sorry, 7 p.m. Central Time, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, there's going to be a webinar take place about treating water up to Red Cross standards. Okay, and it's going to be done using the survival steel. And it'll be hosted by myself and Glenn Matter, which is the creator of the survival steel. And you can find all the information in the video description below to get yourself signed up on the web link to show up for the webinar and learn this valuable information and listen. If you've seen my slot on Doomsday Preppers, you know one of the biggest hits I took on my score was water. I only have two things in my house that can do all the water filtration that I would need in case of emergency. The survival still is one of them. Okay, so I encourage you to check this webinar out. It's the first time I've ever done anything like this. I spoke at Expo, stuff like that, but I've never done anything like this. So I think what we're going to do is uh, I'll be introducing Glenn at the beginning of the webinar. He'll be teaching and showing this class. It's totally free. And then at the end of it, me and him both, I think, are going to do Q&A. So if you have questions, we're going to have answers for you. I've personally tested this and used it myself. Drunk the water from it. It did not kill me. I've tried to poison myself with this. Okay? So it, it works great. And a lot of people have contacted me over time asking about this. So here's the opportunity. You can learn to distill water. Purify it to Red Cross standards, get heavy metals, all sorts of things out of it in an emergency. And it's just valuable knowledge that later down the road may save your life. So make sure to check the video link below that will take you directly to survivalsteel.com to the sign up page for the, the event. And we'll see you there. So until we see you again here at Seven Trumpets Prepper Channel, I hope you have a most blessed day in Yahushua name.